Thanks, Julie. It is now time for a pet of the week. Caulfield is in need of a lucky home. Joining us now with more on how you can adopt him is Jackie Patel. Thanks so much for being here. Tell me a little bit about this uh, kind of mellow fellow. He's got yeah. some health issues. Well, the y yes and no. Yes. Um, it's it's more of a, a physical appearance thing. Um, okay. So this is Caulfield. He's our six-year-old Chihuahua mix, and you're right. He's very gentle, very sweet, affectionate. Is you know loves to be social, loves meeting new friends. Even just out in the studio, he you know ran on his own to go meet um, some of his new buddies. He's very good actually with other dogs too. He lives at the shelter with um, two other animals that are housed in his condo, and, they, and they're very sweet together. Um, but he has, and I'll just kind of just show you, he's our tripod dog. Um, so he's missing one of his back legs, and he came to us from a different shelter, and he had a leg deformity, and because of the leg deformity, he wasn't able to use the back leg. And so that lack of movement started causing pain for him, and so our veterinarians felt that in his best interest, um, you know, we should amputate his leg so that it doesn't really hinder any more of his, um, his ability. So he goes on walks like every dog. He, you know, romps around the house. Um, so he really is kind of your, you know, typical fun-loving dog. Gotcha. So he's just learned to compensate for, for being on three legs or he's yes. got, you know, some kind of equipment that he uses to balance them out? No, no equipment. Um, you know, an adopter, that, that might be something an adopter, you know, would want to do, which would be great, but he, he doesn't really need it. Um, it's, it's, you know, the, the surgery happened not that long ago, so he's still kind of getting a feel for it and figuring things out. Um, going upstairs, he's, you know, a little wary of, but he does it. Um, but, you know, walking around and um, doing his daily walks and his daily exercise, you know, he doesn't know and, and you wouldn't be able to know unless you really kind of zoomed in and saw his his hind leg. So what's the ideal household for him? Like should he be in a household with kids or should they be older or how does that work? Yeah, so you you got it. Um, so a little bit older or at least mature kids just because and it's not necessarily because of the fact that he doesn't have that back leg. He just is kind of more of a gentle boy anyway and so he likes very gentle handling. So you know somebody that has you know mature children if there's no children that's fine too. Um, if there's other dogs in the family that's great. Um, if it's you know, a solo house, that's okay too, as long as the adopter is willing to give him the time commitment, both for the physical and the mental stimulation that he needs every day. He's, he's a great dog. He really is. All right. Well, fantastic. Thank you so much for coming in this morning. And if you want to learn more about how you can uh, bring Caulfield home with you, you can go to our website. We'll be right back.